Hi guys, what's up, Jason here, and welcome back to a brand new FIFA video on my channel. So in today's video, guys, I'm going to be reviewing FIFA 15's Ronaldinho's card. So on FIFA 15, he was an 80-rate card with 53 pace, 72 shooting, 85 passing, 85 dribbling, 29 defending, and 61 physical. So the reason I decided to review this card was because um, in a few weeks, when FIFA 18 is, is released, he will be getting an icon card, and I just really wanted to, you know, get a feel for his card again because um, the last FIFA he was in was FIFA 15 before he, he of course retired so you know I really wanted to try his card out again before the actual game comes out um, so when FIFA 18 does actually come out I am planning to do a series around Ronaldinho once I can get the coins to afford him and I was thinking maybe like a Road to Glory series I was thinking you know Ronaldinho's Road to Glory um, I haven't really you know exactly decided the name yet or what it's going to be around but um, it's going to sort of be like a Road to Glory type of style video with maybe a few extra skill challenges in there or something like that so yeah I'm really excited to do that when FIFA 18 does come out so as you can see there um, getting into his um, the match now as you can see it's got a really nice free kick goal there with Ronaldinho just inside our own half now those free kicks in FIFA 15 were you know just so overpowered all that you need to do um, to do it was press X if you're on Xbox um, make sure it's full power and just hold the left stick up and then it just lobs the goalkeeper um, very simply I don't think you can actually do it in FIFA 17 or it's much harder than FIFA 15 so as you can see he's really good at skills the only thing that really lets him down was his stamina and his pace on FIFA 15 but you know of course on a FIFA 18 that's going to be you know a completely different story because um, this card was based around, you know, of course, the end of his career when he wasn't as fast as he used to be in his prime. I think his prime card on FIFA 18, um, his icon card has 94 pace. You know, there's going to be quite a big difference in pace between this card and his FIFA 18 card. But one difference that you won't really be able to tell is how good he is for scaling. Because look at that, um, really agile for scaling, even though he's pretty slow. Um, we do a really nice running waka waka there. Do a nice Alaska chop, do some scissors there, two double touch spin, doing some more scissors straight into the waka waka, and then look at that, a finesse shot in off the crossbar. That's probably one of my best goals I've ever scored on FIFA. Um, you know, just an incredible, incredible goal there from Ronaldinho. And again here, showing off some skill moves in the 47th minute against this guy. We do a nice running waka waka there to beat the defender. And um, a lot of you guys in the comment section below have been asking me to do a running waka waka review. I'm sorry, not review, um, tutorial, just because a lot of you guys seem to find it hard, you know, to get the timing right and to be able to do it consistently. So when the FIFA 18 demo comes out, I should definitely be bringing out, you know, um, an in-depth um, waka waka tutorial so it can help you guys learn the skill more easily. Because, you know, it's not just about, you know, doing performing um, the skill moves with the sticks. You know, it's all about timing and the speed of your player. So, you know, I'll go into more depth about that when I make the tutorial. But anyway, getting back into the review here again with Ronaldinho running through there, doing a nice heel to heel to a, la um, to a fake Rabona there, do some scissors, cut inside, and then a really nice finish with him um, and one thing I did actually find with his card on FIFA 15 was his finishing is actually pretty decent so hopefully in FIFA 18 if he keeps all his you know um, pros he's got on FIFA 15 and along with his pace and um, what he should have on FIFA 18 this card is you know just going to be honestly incredible um, so as you can see here we get it on the edge of the box there do a really nice scissors there two double trip spin and then we score a really nice long shot so guys this is going to be the end of the video if you have enjoyed it don't forget to leave a like and subscribe to my channel thanks for watching and see you next time bye